G'day guys and welcome back to Sci-Fi Con 14 Relay for Life here in Second Life. This is day four. <coughs> um, and this is the sim that this is Violet Street and this is the sim where I have mine on. So we're actually if I click and be able to move. Um, I'll uh, well I'll be showing you my my stuff up first, uh, it's just around the corner there on the left, um, but we'll go through this stuff first and then we'll head over to mine. So <coughs> the person <coughs> that has built this sim, um, this is their shop. So the, the face that I showed you and some of the buildings that I showed you in the first video, um, she has made those. So, and I'm guessing it's the same person that also has some stuff on the other sim next to us. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry. <coughs> the coughs are coming. Okay. So. What's up? So I guess we'll add 50 linden into this. Okay. <coughs> it's like a little... Oh, it's a game. It's a game room. So they've got games people can play. I don't know what game it is. No current game. Touch board for rules. Alright. Okay, I don't know what game it is. It might be like something like um, Battleship or something like that, or a couple of different games. <coughs> oh, yep. So. We'll add 50 in here as well. Alright. So there's, uh, I'm guessing um, there's a mermaid in there. It's like a living world fish tank. Well, <laughs> but wait, hang on. It's just, is this just a pile of rocks? Oh, yeah, it is. <laughs> <coughs> Very cool. And that's actually a person in there. Well, an avatar, at least. <laughs> this one is not. This one here, someone wasn't able to rent, so they just put the building there. And we've got a couple of people out in front of the maze at the moment, so um, we're going to go and do it right now. So it says, Welcome to the Relay for Life maze. You will start here and find your way to the middle of the maze where you'll find a surprise. For a better experience, put yourself into mouse look and enjoy this maze I made for you. Thank you for stopping by. Have a nice day and don't forget to donate some linden to Relay for Life. <coughs> so I have a vendor here that you can buy this mansion and then you can you can change it, you can texture it, you know, you can make it what you like, but it's just a basic mansion that I've built a uh, few well, while ago now, maybe five, six years ago, um, but um, yeah, I built it for someone who wanted to, for their clan. Alright, and this one here is a raffle, which is going to end in 17 hours, um, but I'm going to do it at, do it again um, until the 29th, so it's going to be, there's going to be two raffles there. <coughs> <clears throat> All right, so let's go into Mouse Look. There's David Tennant right there, the the tenth Doctor. <clears throat> We've had 467 people in total and 93 today. So let's go and do this maze. So unfortunately, I don't know if it's they're gonna res out, but I have been having troubles with some of the items in my maze that haven't been resing properly. So there's Rose Tyler. Um, Rose Taylor, Rose Taylor, I think it's Taylor, 
Uh, she uh, was one of the assistants of the doctor, one of the friends, one of the travelers. Anyway, um, <coughs> let's go through. So, I just, I know it, this isn't the way, but if it's not there, it's not there. So, for some reason, I've got weeping angels in, like, here, but they're not showing up for me for some reason. They are showing up for other people, just not me. For, I don't know why. Something's gone wrong in my settings, and but anyway. So, we'll just do the maze. Like, even Missy. Missy's meant to be there, but I don't I can't see her. I don't know why. It's only... I can only see Rose, and I can only see, um... The Doctor. Like, and they're all the same kind of, um... <clears throat> uh... Prim. Like, they're, they're the same kind of, uh, Prim, but... Yeah, I don't get it. I don't know why I can't see them. I did have some Daleks in here as well, but I decided to take them out because they were very annoying. They were like, exterminate, exterminate, <laughs> halt, stop. They just kept on talking. I was like, dude, that's annoying. <clears throat> so here we go. Here we are. We're in the middle of the maze. So this is the middle of the maze. Um, this is where you can, if you get here, you can uh, donate here, and then the hunt um, thing is up here, and if you touch that, uh, it will give you a Relay for Life bangle, uh, and you can buy it for zero linden, um, and this does nothing, even though you can sit on it, it does nothing anyway, um, I don't have a TARDIS or anything like that, um, I, I mean, I could have maybe done it, but um, built like, but I didn't have time. I, I had time to build the maze and, and put some stuff in it and yeah. So <coughs> unfortunately as well, I um I'm not here for I'm not here to sell anything really. I'm just here to promote Relay for Life. <coughs> and um I did give people the option to add um surprises in the maze, like, for the hunt and or stuff like that, um, to, um, put, like, if someone came by, say, for instance, someone came by, right, and they were in the maze, and they got to, say, I'm just, let's just, let's just say, for instance, like, I gave people a massive opportunity to promote their stuff, but they, they are, oh, whatever. Anyway, so they could have had something hiding hiding behind Rose, right? A little box or a little something, right? Or behind her and, um, or, or you know, and, and someone would grab it and grab a landmark to go to their, <coughs> their, um, their store or their, their, their sim or, you know, a bunch of stuff. I was just trying to help out and, but no one took, no one took my help. So I was like, well, uh, if you're not if you're not gonna take my generosity, then you know, whatever. So um, I'm only here to help other people, and if people don't want my help, then fine. I mean, I've had what? How many people have I had through the uh, through this maze? I've had 469 people. That's 469 people that could have come and saw your store. I mean, I'm sure they've been through. I mean, I'm going through everything as well, but. They've got now a landmark to your store, a landmark to your main, a landmark to, you know, a lot of people don't, <clears throat> a lot of people ignore those little things that come up, oh, you know, may not, you know, may not go there, you know, so, but if people take, touch a link, like, because they've, they've found something, you know, because it's, you know, whatever, but anyway, enough of that, <coughs> if you don't want my help, then, um, so be it. Anyhow, so I'm gonna make this an even two grand right here. <coughs> and go in. And they've got. The Ages of Uru. So. 
Um. Oh, oh. Bloody notifications. Anyway. <laughs> Um, so, yep, cool, cool, hey, what the heck? Huh? I swear to God, I just put 50 Linden in that, and it was at 1950, and now it's still at 1950. It should have went to 2000. Why? I don't understand. Whatever. <coughs> Glitch. <coughs> Alright, so I'm not exactly sure what this is, but uh, it looks really cool. Um, I think it's just here for show. It's one of the person's um, creations. <coughs> there we go. Oh, so, oh, hang on, what's this, oh, I thought it was a, a doorway, <laughs> I think it's a role play sim, for Star Trek, hangout area and um, information center <coughs> oh my gosh why does this happen to me all the time hang on a sec guys So, uh, here we have some more Stargate, Stargate, Star Trek stuff, oh my god, I can't believe I said Stargate. Anyway, um, <coughs> Star Trek is not one of my things. I'm a Star Wars fan, I've always been a Star Wars fan, I'm also a Stargate fan as well. So that's why I said Star Trek instead of Star Trek. But apparently, um, on Foxtel at the moment, if you live in Australia, on Foxtel at the moment, there is a dedicated, dedicated channel to Star Trek, and they're doing uh, like massive. Uh, so this is a role play sim for Star Trek. Um, yeah. So, um, <coughs> oh my gosh, I will talk to him in a little bit. Um, so let's go uh, let's pay this one fifty. <coughs> how do we get in here? Seriously, how do we get in? Or is it part of what? How do we get in there? Oh, very cool. Oh, it's... Can I hit bees? Oh. 
Yeah. You can hear beats. That's quite cool. Very cool. Naturistic. <clears throat> um. Exhibit. So another Star Trek key um, role play exhibit. Um, that's off to the next sim. So that's tomorrow's sim, but we won't be going down there just yet. <coughs> supporting my region. This is me supporting my region. <coughs> <coughs> um, cool. We'll shop for clothes. <coughs> oh, man. Hang on a second, guys. I gotta. Hi. Oh wait. I sh. Oh yeah. I'll just do it. So, this is Solaris, which is another um, roleplay sim for Star Trek. So, a lot of Star Trek on this sim. Um, that I sim, I just remembered, actually, was probably more Star Wars. Well, they've got Putt Putt here too. But I don't know how well this one works. But I'm sh wait. Do I can I get a landmark? How do I get a no? I don't know. <coughs> to maybe look at it another time. Oh, I don't want to go this way. I want to go because there's a place over here we want to have a look at. So, coming over here, oh, okay, so it's more, it's not rising in very well, but it's just trees, so the trees behind is what they're, they're selling. Very cool, they don't have a proper vendor out, I don't feel like I don't particularly want plants. <laughs> um, what is this? Right, so let's pay. Okay. So, oh, there we go. I don't know. I I have a funny feeling this is like a cyborg thing. Ooh. Very cool. Your Thank you. Cool. Thank you. Is that it? That is it. I'm sure there's more.
to that. I'm, I can't really see, but over seven years of history. Okay, cool. Um, <clears throat> this looks very cool too. Very cool garden. We'll put some linden in here. Um, and they have a shop as well. Very um, Asian, very Asian style um, house. Wait. And Nara knew the most important core was her own. <clears throat> right. Oh, it's a comic. Oh, I see. Okay, okay, okay. I just noticed that. All right, all right. So, traveling through the black. Meeting and assisting many cultures. A heart for the many, not for the few, and then you know I knew the most important call was her own. Hmm. Interesting. Very interesting. Alright, so there's something up here too. <coughs> um do I Oh, I have to touch this one to open it. Ooh, very cool. A oh, bull does. Lots of bull does. Okay, um, there's something across the way. Tai, you can do Tai Chi. Oh, let's do Tai Chi. Come on. Who doesn't want to do some Tai Chi here? Sit. Uh, uh, is. Is it going to do what? Huh? Oh, okay, uh, I'm doing something. It's it's slowly. It's slow, but it's doing it. Tai Chi is really slow, isn't it? This is really slow. <laughs> anyway, I wish it was just a tad little faster for this video, but yeah, that's cool anyway. Um, <clears throat> very cool. So we got a f we got a first aid um, kitchen or something. Kitchen? Is it a kitchen? Oh, it's like a Kitchen with a bed and little tiny homes. Yeah, cool. Awesome. I really do like those kind of things. And Dan. Oh, okay. So, and Dan. Um, <clears throat> we'd already seen this exhibit yesterday. I didn't realize that it was on this sim. So. <clears throat> Um, so we got Umbra, I think it's it, and they sell, I don't know, it's not rising in, and then it's like furniture, there is an upstairs part, we'll just pay this though, Biddy. <coughs> I'll just quickly go up. Oh my god. Oh my god, didn't make it. Oh no, there's nothing there. What the? <laughs> I thought there was something there, but there wasn't. Anyway. <clears throat> Put Fiddy in here. A lot of, uh, this sim hasn't, hasn't had a lot of people come through. Right, it probably has, but not a lot of people who... Uh, some of the sims I've seen, people have made like 11,000, you know... Linden for Relay for Life in one thing, and you know, yeah, so, so a greenhouse. 
That's very cool. We're making making the good stuff, you know. So I'm guessing this is like hospital. Cool. Very cool. Oh uh, no, I'm gonna go there. Um, yeah, I've noticed that there's not not a lot of people have had donations, like big donations. So, except for mine, I've like had a thousand. Someone donated a thousand in mine. Ooh, okay, fair enough. Um, I do have to delete some things. <coughs> Very cool. So no one took that shop, and no one took that shop. I don't think. Doesn't look like it. Mm -mm. Um, no one took that shop over there. This one, someone has. And I think they do clothing and a few other bits and pieces, accessories. <coughs> Couple more kiosks for shirts and stuff for relay for life. Nothing. Uh, wait. Oh no, there's nothing on the left. Um, have another one here on the right. No kiosk station to add Linden to though. No. These guys do over here. Oh, another. It's a, it's more of a golf sim than, oh, oh yeah, I'll, let's, um, let's get that landmark. I might be able to, uh, go and check out that, that, that might be quite cool. Um, it off on their sim though, like just, I know, it, I know it has nothing to do with Relay for Life, but <clears throat> it'd be good to go and check that out for a video one day. Um... Oh, these guys have had no donations. Oh my gosh, that's so crappy. People, not even giving anything. Like, I mean, a bunch of people are giving, but seriously, to on the fourth day and someone, like, oh, this one doesn't have have hasn't got this one set up. So to have something and not, oh, I can go through. <laughs> And not have um, any donations at all after the fourth day. That's quite bad. Alright guys, so you know what to do. Hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, share. And I'll see you guys in the next video tomorrow. Going to this sim that is right in front of us. Uh, that is tomorrow. And uh, on that note. Um, take care and I'll see you again soon. Bye-bye.